Well, I suppose it's time to deal with an annoying Lamia. Damn, these pop up in games everywhere. Ah, she's been eating her eggs, huh? Yeah, I don't think apologies are going to help here. <laughs> Feel better, huh? Don't you be kind of dead? Well, now. Let's see. Um, let's take out the drone first. Well, that was nice. But I want to cut down this drone. If just to save myself a little effort and get regenerate up. I don't think they have access to the great equalizer, so that'll help me out. Then we'll try and take down this guy. Okay, good. The, the Lamia's all by herself. Of course, she's spreading status effects, damn her. Okay, let's gouge her eyes out. And, um, command strike. You, um, cleanse. Problem is, you know, I can only cleanse one person at a time. Ah. Just give herself a ton of boost. That's annoying. But we can't hit her with poison, so I guess that'll work out. Oh, damn, more boost. And got rid of poison. Great. Problem is I can't really buff myself again. Okay, let's um, debilitate you. Damn, you're in your tidal wave. Venom Claw. Just not doing enough damage here. Come on. Just need to pierce our way through. Um. We still have regen. I guess we'll offer some curing, though. Definitely seen better days. Hoping for a bit more power behind that. Um. More of that tech resistance, I guess. How are you even still alive, man? Um, regenerate? I guess it gives some health recovery. Um, definitely want to make sure this thing's poisoned. Hey, it's incapacitated. Great. Well, let's see. Items. Yep, guess we'll use up a branch of life. Get back up, Sullivan. Then instantly killed again by a tidal wave. Gosh darn it. Well, try this again. Let's see. Item. Let's see. Do I have a good item that can heal me here? Stores all HP and MP of one character. I don't want to waste that. Rain of Rejuvenation. Because I guess we do have some serious damage on a couple of characters here. Um, paralysis, huh? Well, we'll get rid of that debuff. After all, we really want her to be shooting. You know? Don't stop shooting, Tex. And keep up the regenerates, because, you know, they do restore health to everybody. Just darn it. Um. I'll try and taunt. That way, you know, he's the target instead of, um, Claret. Because that is bloody annoying. Um. Let's see. Skill. Regenerate again, you know, because we can always back up to that recovery point, right? Oh, they're going to get blood tapped again. Well, whatever. The fight's going to be over for that really matters. Though we did lose two of our branches. Oh, that sucks. Well. Got you out of the way. Let's grab this stuff, you know, before we leave, because we have to have to have a tough fight to get to it, so we might as well make sure we take all the ore with us. I mean, we deserve it. We had to bust our butts there. And boom. Free recovery. Now to head through here. 
Hmm. A ladder, eh? I'm guessing I can't reach that, though. It's just trying to tempt me with my inability to jump. Damn you, game. And there's the exit. Okay. A mushroom of magic. Odd. Well, I guess we made the new arc. Yep, this is new arc. A bunch of folks from the sea got together and built it not too long ago. Are they part of the rebellion? Not really, though. I've been able to nab a few recruits from here. They want the same thing we do. Freedom. Just aren't willing to fight for it. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with being peaceful. Yeah, I suppose they did. But hiding from the problem ain't gonna solve it. Yeah, you're a little hole in the wall. We actually left the sea in search of other humans. Some are traitors who make it to the port district, but they don't reveal anything about the outside world. Likely to keep it safe from the Skyborn. You have inside the cell here, where we can live our lives in total freedom and security. Yeah, we'll see about that. This place is probably going to get attacked at some point. Oh, you got that right. Oh, I'm not interested in the tranquility of the forest. I really ain't. Okay, we can get some free levels there, at least. And we can see the inside of another building. Nice. Apparently there's no privacy in this city. Like, you can see your neighbors through the walls. Help each other out, huh? Okay, what's this? Hmm, Mount what? So the Dora Volcano stands between us and the desert. Basic geography. Hmm, brave deeds, huh? So, what exactly did we do? We get a superpower now? Did we just raise our base stats? What did you do? Pure gunnery? Or battle for them with technology process as a demolitionist? Gunner. I can either focus on protecting myself and my fragile allies better as a fencer? Or on offense as a duelist, striking even more fear into my enemy. Um, fencer. Oh, as far as I can use them to my advantage. Well, obviously we want to keep a healer around, so you're going to be a Templar, gosh darn it. You're saying my pure qualifying skills are cultivating my sneaky stealth abilities as a rogue. Well, rogues are always awesome, so we're going rogue. But, let's see what you got. A bazaar, huh? Well, let's shop for augments. What you got? Weapon by, um, plus 30 strength, huh? Well, now. A tier. For magic and tech damage. Shield plus 150 intelligence. That's a rather powerful boost right there. What's this do? Plus one level to all resistances. Oh, plus 20 to all stats on armor. I love how the intelligent buffs are way crazier. And there's the speed buffs there. Um, love how that goes nowhere, though. I gotta think about that. Like, do I want to... Equip a new weapon, start messing with the augments on them. Add an augment. Let's see. Yep, plus I five percent of weapon power. I'd have to destroy an augment there. We could always throw on um the fun of a giant ruby cluster though. Oh yeah, we already went through here. It's nice to know there's two doors out of there. But what's down here, then? An inn. An item shop, I assume. Hmm, something str strong, that stuff. Any piece of equipment by adding iron and coal together. I suppose. 
Um, tier three. <laughs> Don't have that same materials, huh? Um, how much um platina do we have? Just two. I guess technically I can make the highest quality versions of those, but I don't know if I want to. That's the problem, that he's not telling me exactly what the end result will be. Is it particularly worthwhile? That is a question to ask. Nothing like the moonshine when the guards aren't regulated in its contents. Wee! Okay, so we can buy potions, restore HP 50% um, of the character. For four, we can get this for 33% on all characters. I think we're going to get a couple branches because we did lose a few. I wish we could farm fights in this game, though, since it would be easier to really buy up all those items. And augments, you know, but I guess it's just how it is, you know. If they didn't restrict how much cash you get out of the game, it would just be too broken because I'd be able to strap the most powerful augments imaginable, you know, from these clusters onto my stuff. Let's see what you got. Plus 16 strength. Plus 32 to agility, huh? Well, now. I think we'll take that. And slap it on somebody, maybe. Can I have two of those on? With accessories? Yeah, yeah, I can. Okay, so we're gonna grab that speed boost. I really want it. And then for augments, I guess we'll take a look. Let's see. Um, I think we'll buy a ruby cluster to slap on that one gun to raise its attack power. Because, let's face it, I love raising attack power. And that should be thrown on someone with magic casting. But I don't think we have one yet. I mean, we could have, I guess, turned our um, healer into one, but we decided to dump all his power into healing, because, you know, that's far more useful, because good heal spells are hard to come by. Um, you any skills that really help out with that? From this attack to an ally, or double to self. And eh, no. What do you got here? Oh, revive, huh? And this heals all allies. That's what I'm talking about. What do you? Oh, he gets a high threat attack, cancels enemy buffs. So what we are already facing. And this slows all enemies down. So this is a good item to have. Why does he get automatic regeneration anyway? Um, never mind. Augment. Let's see. Add an augment. Can I just slap another one on there? Um. Yep. Can I just power you up more? Ferocity. But will I lose my poison? That's the question. I guess so. But we do have ferocity going for us now, so we are stronger. Maybe terrifyingly so. Okay. Guess we're going to have to go into the secret volcano lair. Ugh. Yeah, a locked door. It doesn't even have a lock to pick. Puzzle doors. We just need to find the color switches for this floor. Four corners. Great. Which probably means we're going to have to fight to get to them, right? Because I'm assuming now they're going to be guarded. So, let's go this way first. Um, let's see. Can we poison you? Not for the band leader gets to soften up our, weak our weaknesses, huh? I don't have enough for shockwave. Gosh darn it. Um, 
let's see. We'll haste her up. Because Claret needs it. She needs the speed. I mean, she's got amazing power. But without the speed, it's kind of hopeless. Okay, spread some damage there. And now she's a target, because she's just that fast. Not that fast, just that powerful. Um, pff, taunt. Well, that worked out. Um, heal her up. Come on, you can take it, man. Just take him for the team. Ooh, got gouged. Well, let's see. Let's shockwave you two. Doesn't have to do a lot, just slow you down. And let's see. Circle of healing is too much. Let's just offer him a minor heal, I guess. And fam you up. And hopefully finish you off, right? And how did you survive that? That durability is impressive. Just fall, will you? And, um, distracting strike. Um, let's see. Torwin. And she still went after Sullivan, gosh darn it. Guard, will you? You? Lazarus. Revive this fallen man. Um, guess we'll cut her a bit. And Venom Claw. Come on. Soften her up there, right? And just finish her off, will you? Just let Claire get her shots off. Man, she needs way more speed. Well, we're almost uh, one button, maybe. Jeez. So I come in from the other side. Oh my god. Okay. Um. Just heal up, will you? Damn, that heal's weak. Um. Let's see. Can we get Vimus Cloth? Yep. Uh, poisonous Scorpion. There's something funny about that. Well, we're gonna have you guard. Try and regenerate as much magic as possible. My god. Sullivan just gets wrecked, man. Fight just started and he's already almost dead. Ugh. Just hit like trucks. Guess I should have bought more upgrades to my armor. Or tried to forge new weapons. Well, let's um, resurrect the dead again. Doesn't have to be recreated uh, maximum health. Just bring them back. Okay, let's hit. It's not like he's going to probably draw the attacks anyway. It's not exactly pulling aggro at the moment. Come on, just fall over, will you? And we probably should heal up before we get into another fight. I wish Lazarus offered up a little bit more. Oh, great, some snakes. Well, I'll poison them first. Great equalizer. That'll help out. Block the attack, but not the poison damage. Um, cleanse. So that'll help him out a little bit. 
and let's um take care of that snake. Come on, just a little bit more. Now eh, we're not gonna beat the anaconda here. Though why anacondas are shooting off venomous barbs, I don't know. I mean, anacondas are a restrictor. They choke you to death. They don't poison you. Completely different kind of snake there, you know? Jeez, I guess we'll go for that power up there. Um, because I just can't leave it behind. I just really, really want it. Um, Commandora. Like, I need more power, you know? I never have too much of that. Um, cure. Not gonna be enough to really matter, but, yeah, make her feel a bit safer. And let's put the smartness on you. Sullivan, keep it up. Horwin, just guard, will you? Come on. Finish it off. Thank you. Level 14, huh? That's just doesn't feel like enough, right? Not for what we're dealing with. Well, next time I guess we'll push the first big button. Until then, see ya.